How is the patient properly prepared for local anesthetic injection? Prior to administering a local anesthetic, the patient must be evaluated for their ability to safely tolerate the stresses, both psychological and physiological, involved in the planned dental treatment. The steps involved include a medical history questionnaire, a physical examination which includes vital signs such as the blood pressure, the heart rate and rhythm, and respiratory rate. We will then determine the patient's medical risk and any necessary treatment modifications. The ASA Physical Status Classification System helps us to determine medical risk during dental treatment. An ASA-1 is defined as a normal healthy patient. ASA-2, a person with a mild systemic disease. ASA-3, a more severe systemic disease which limits activity but is not incapacitating. ASA-4 is an incapacitating systemic disease that represents a constant threat to the patient's life. ASA-1, 2, and 3 patients are candidates for elective dental care. The use of local anesthetics with or without vasoconstrictors is indicated. ASA 4, 5, and 6 patients are not candidates for elective dental care. So if you had a history of high blood pressure? Okay, well, you're running a little high today. And how about your sugar? Well, it's about 300 something in that 300. You know, you have some serious dental problems, but uh, the best thing for you to do is see your physician, get everything medically controlled before we do any work on you. Consideration for decreasing stress to the patient during dental treatment minimizes the risk of an acute medical emergency arising. Steps to be considered include the following. Sedation the evening before or the morning of the planned dental treatment. Intraoperative sedation, effective pain control during their treatment, a morning appointment, time factor, the appointment length should not exceed the patient's tolerance. Now, we're going to have four appointments. I've decided because of your apprehension, we're going to have short appointments. Every appointment will be no longer than 30 minutes. Hot, humid weather. The consideration for post-operative prescriptions if needed. Post-operative telephone call the evening following dental treatment. Hello. Hi, Julie. This is Linda at Dr. Stan's office, and the doctor asked me to call you and see how you're doing today. Oh, just fine. Thank you. And please tell Dr. Stan I appreciate his consideration. I'll let the doctor know. Thank you. Bye.